So you got maintenance and stuff like that possibly that come up or supervised? When we announced our layoff uh, a month or so ago, we had several employers call us and uh, tell us that they had jobs available for, for the employees. And so what we decided was to bring all those employers together in one place, give our employees that are going to experience a layoff an opportunity to meet those, those employers and hopefully land another job. In, in, in our business, we had a couple open positions at Pioneer's Oshkosh location. So our goal was to come here today and, and uh, meet as many of the employees that were displaced from Oshkosh Corporation and see if we couldn't add some more talent to uh, the Pioneer team in Oshkosh. Oshkosh Corp is having their layoff, you know, and uh, we've got approximately 700 people being cut. I'm one of them. Um, so I thought I'd come out and check out the opportunities. You know, if it's something to think about and things don't go well around... Today the defense industry is down, but the other employers in the area are experiencing significant upturn. So there's lot, lots of jobs available for our employees that are leaving today, and we're actually experiencing a lot of people leave ahead of being laid off because they're finding good jobs and they're leaving soon. That's why our numbers went down from 700 to almost 530, uh, 530 people getting laid off uh, because there's so many jobs available right now. We've got a huge stack of resumes over there from the individuals that have visited our booth and I would say we have probably at least five or ten that we've flagged as people that we could envision being a part of our organization already. So I've, I've been to this type of situation before. This has happened before and I've, we'll get through it. So we've got a lot of good people at Oshkosh and uh, uh, I'm sure we'll do well.